every day we get up and go out and hang on buildings. By the grace of God, if we make it back. Yeah. Oops, is not an option in this type of work. If you're on 40 story buildings standing on a, a piece of tin and you look down and there's nothing below you but the ground, you know you need the Lord right away. And it was on Good Friday. Yes, it was. Good Friday. On Good Friday. And I have to say it was a Good Friday. And yes, it was. Yes. I had fell four floors before I grabbed the rope. When I grabbed the rope, it burnt my hand. You know, when somebody called you and said, yeah, your uh, husband uh, fell off the building. I yeah, I know you were in shock. Oh, you couldn't stop. I held on to that rope. I pulled my arm out of socket, and but I still held on. And then I noticed a window was up right by me. I kicked my foot and raised that window up and went in the window. And uh, everybody was screaming, oh, God, he fell. And I said, I fell into the hands of God. <laughs> Before I was a pastor, before I even uh, started preaching, I seen a guy shot and I ran there and grabbed him and started praying for him. If you know your name, uh, you need to praise God. Because... Well, everybody else was standing back looking around. You have to be a Christian at all times. You can't be a part-time Christian. This guy ain't left yet. I'm gonna go around and come back because our shop is right there where I see this other guy sitting. Buenos dias, el maestro está. ¿Qué pasó, papá? Bien, bien, usted. ¿Qué pasó? ¿Dónde está mi rookie? No, sé. No traga la crudo. ¿Otra vez? A lo mejor. No sé. Yeah, it's coming, yo creo. Él me dice que viene al edificio, pero tú sabes, está peligroso cuando está lloviendo. Yeah, OK, hoy yo vine. Uh, yo espero usted en el despacho, OK? Yeah, I'm just going to take my ropes and stuff to the roof. And the reason why I wait till 8 because one morning I dropped over the wall and the lady was standing there naked right inside of the window. And I said, oh, I'm sorry. She's like, ah, ah. I said, oh, I'm sorry. She said, how do I look? Oh, God. <laughs> I said, I'm knowing the guy you shouldn't ask that question. She's like, why? I said, I'm a preacher and you're making me sin. <laughs> he looked fine. <laughs> Hand, no hands, and I go to work. A minister, you need to have a ministry. You need to serve somebody. 
Do you feed the homeless? Do you uh, deal with the alcoholics and the drug addicts? Or do you have a job ministry? Do you have something? What are you doing to help people? You, you did the, the economy's so bad that we getting people who used to have jobs and don't have jobs now, and they're ashamed to even come to the church and ask for help. There's a lot of people that say, I believe, but once you really know God, you know some things. You should get from beyond belief to knowledge. anybody out. I have no heaven or hell to put you in. I hope you all make it.